Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. How you doing? So today I am going to be showing you guys my closet. The reason why I'm gonna show you guys my closet is because I am going to be doing a closet sale. Yay! I haven't done a closet sale in a long time. It's probably been a couple years, but at this time I'm gonna be using Poshmark. And if you guys don't know about Poshmark, Poshmark is an app. You can also shop Poshmark on the computer, but most people use their phone. Um, it's an app where you can shop people's closets. So basically I upload all of the stuff that I wanna sell, you buy it, and I send it to you. You can shop Nike, Adidas, uh, Victoria's Secret Pink, you can shop Louis Vuitton, all different kinds of high-end to low-end brands that you like are on Poshmark, like literally anything. But I am gonna be selling a wide range of things because, <laughs> y'all, I just cleaned out my closet and I have so much stuff, it is ridiculous. Ridiculous. My intention was to show you guys the actual process of us cleaning out my closet, but it was so chaotic and I was just trying to get it done really quickly. I had my assistant helping me do it and so we were just going in and I didn't realize that I hadn't actually filmed the majority of the process, but I'll show you guys my closet update if you guys wanna see it. I've never shown you guys my closet before because to be fair, my closet is always a hot mess. So I've never shown you guys my closet. Um, it, it's never been organized, it's never been clean. It's like, since I moved here, it has not been clean, ever. So I never showed y'all because I didn't want you guys to see my mess. <laughs> this is my closet. Um, and it is pretty deep. I mean, if you if you look at it, it's, it's a nice walk-in size, right? Um, when we moved here, the guy that lived here he put in this whole system where there's like speakers. There are these speakers that he hooked up and that way we can like watch, it's connected to the TV, so we can watch TV and or we can play music in our bedroom, you know, just going down in the DMs, you know what I'm saying? Um, and then it also hooks up to every room in the house and we'll play music throughout the house, so like music in the garage even. So, I mean, it's pretty cool, but it's ancient and it looks a mess. There's There's gotta be a more technologically advanced way to do this. I, we just don't know how. So right now, all this stuff is still in here. But he left this whole unit in here and I didn't know what to do with it because it's not really functional, right? So I just put all my shoes on it. So currently, all my Nikes, my Pumas, my Adidas, a lot of my sneakers and comfortable casual shoes are here. I also have hats in this shoe box. Shout out to my assistant, Kristen, she's bomb. She did this for me. I have purses back there. Um, and then all of my other shoes are here. We're in the process of taking pictures of every shoe and putting it on there so I know what shoe it is. Cause this is not really cute, but I like to keep my boxes cause I like to know what's in each box. But um, yeah, and then I have all my hats. All my hats are up there and hanging. Um, all of my uh, rounder hats. And I haven't figured out how to store my belts yet because I'm currently using my belt hanger for my tank tops um, because this is just functional for me to have all of my tanks on my belt hanger. Uh, this is my corsets. They're on a tie rack. Um, I have all my white pants, which I didn't realize how many white pants I had, but all my white pants are on this hanger thing. And then these are all my skirts. These are all my jeans. This stuff might move around, but we're working on it. And then I got these doubler rack things from Amazon because this closet is not really, it doesn't really have a closet system in it. So I'm working with what I got, okay? Because um, I'm not going to put a closet system in here because I'm not going to be in this house very long. So I'm not about to build no whole closet system and deck it out and then move out and rent this place. You know what I'm saying? So um, I got these doubler rack things. Oh, hi, Gigi. Um, there's another one over here, if you guys can see that. But on the bottom here, I have all of my pants, which I need to color coordinate because they're not organized. But I just threw them on here because I was tired. They're on pant hangers. They're on pant hangers so that you can just slide the pant on there. So yeah, all my pants. There's a few shorter skirts on here. Um, and then these are all of my short tops. 
she organized this in a very H&M way and I don't really like it. I think I'm going to go back to the original way that I had my shirts and stuff organized because I like to be able to see everything by color. I don't know why. I just like everything by color. This is confusing to me. But her reasoning was that I could stack the shorter tops on top of the pants and then have like my longer tops and longer things hanging over here. But eh, I don't know. It's not really like as organized as I would want it to be. I guess I just don't really know what's going on because I didn't do it, but yeah. Um, and then I got my jumpsuits, all my jumpsuits and my dresses back here. These are all my sweats. I decided to hang all my sweats because they were all in a bin folded, but they don't stay folded. So we just gonna hang it because hanging is probably going to work a little bit better for me. So all of my bottoms are down here. All of my tops are up here, all my sweats and athletic tops. These are all my jackets, so all my denim. You gotta have denim. This is all of my other jackets and heavier coats. And down here, we have my baggings. The le they're like leggings with the shoe in them. I don't know if I've showed you all those, but they're funny. She called them baggings. So we put baggings, denim over the knee boots are in there, and then all of my flat feet stuff, sandals and things that I shouldn't wear because I have flat feet, which is why we put flat foot on there. Um, these are all in here, so more seasonal items, and these are like scarves and gloves and hats and stuff for the winter time. These are seasonal as well, so these are in here. So yeah, I'm trying to get all of my hangers to match, um, because I hate when my hangers don't match. These are all felt hangers from Amazon, um, and they're pretty inexpensive. I believe a box of these a box of a hundred was like thirty dollars i'm gonna go through and make sure to get out all of the ones that don't match like these green ones that i've had forever and get out all these plastic ones because these plastic walmart hangers break so easy so i'm tired of those this double rack hanger thing is from amazon as well um so i have two of those and then the bins that i have i don't remember where i got those bins from i want to say they're from container store a lot of my bins are being used for makeup purposes right now, so that's why I have so many shoe boxes. <laughs> but clear bins would be ideal for your shoes if you wanted to um, stack them in there. I have two dressers in my bedroom that have my underwear, socks, uh, layering pieces, leggings, t-shirts, shorts, and skirts, shorter skirts. And that's not everything. I needed to organize my closet because I have so many clothes outside of my closet because I was literally, like it would give me anxiety coming in here. It was a mess. So we took everything out that I don't wear, that I don't want, and that I wanna give away. We took a lot of stuff to Goodwill, but a lot of my stuff had tags on it, it was brand new, or it was just really cute stuff that I didn't wanna give away because I paid some money for it, you know what I'm saying? All of that stuff is sitting right here. This is all the stuff that I'm selling. This was all in my closet, y'all. Um, this is all the new stuff that I have <laughs> that I need to put in my closet because I was afraid to go in there. So it was just living out here. Um, and then that's my rack of new things that I want to wear or things, ideas, outfit ideas that I have that I want to put together. So I just need to get my whole life together. Okay. That's why all of this stuff is out here because I was getting my closet organized so that I can put all this in there. My rack is gonna stay out here to keep me organized as well, but that's gonna be like just seasonal, like just a few pieces here and there that I wanna wear, but it's not gonna be a lot of stuff. This needed to come out of my closet and I'm glad that I got it out because now I can breathe, I can see the floor, I can walk in there. Before I could not close the door, like I promise y'all, couldn't close the door. So. This is all of the stuff that I'm gonna be selling on my Poshmark. It's not gonna all go up at once. It's gonna go up 10 items at a time because I obviously can't do all of this in one day. It is all gonna go up eventually. So you guys will be able to shop all of this. And if you have your own Poshmark closet, be sure to let me know what your closet is, what your closet name is, and we can shop each other's closet. Um, I typically find some really cute pieces from people who are also selling things and we become like friends. So, I mean, hey, you never know. A relationship may be forming through our hoarding. Poshmark app is free 99, just download it. I will have a link in the description box to where you can download Poshmark and set up your closet. So this is the Poshmark app and 
You can shop other people's closets. This is my closet that I have. I have two items here already, but I am going to be adding more items in a second. This huge hunk of junk right here is going to all go into my closet. So I should be doing that within the next few minutes. So just to give you an idea of some of the items that I'm going to be selling, can't go through all of it, but I will show you some of it. So this is a Adidas sweatshirt. It is a turtleneck. A lot of this stuff might be winter stuff. Some of y'all still going through winter, so I mean. This is a sweatshirt from Adidas. Um, I believe that this is a size extra small. It's a size extra small. This Adidas jacket, but this one was an, is an extra small. It still has the tag on it. It's a quilted bomber. It fits me kind of big though. It's an extra small, but it fits awkwardly around my shoulders. It makes me look kind of boxy. It fits more like a small, it's like an oversized. So that still got the tags on it, never really wore it. I wore it maybe a couple times, but didn't really get my wear out of it. If you guys remember, I did a coat haul one day and I had this coat in there. I wore it in that video. And that was the last time I wore it. I, I don't know why I thought I was gonna get a lot of wear out of this. This is a cute transitional piece though, from like winter to spring. So if you're still experiencing winter, even though it's springtime, like I am, then this will work for you because you're gonna need a coat until about June. Size two, it still has tags attached. Have not worn it. So listen, get your life, okay? This dress from Nasty Gal, I bought it. Don't know how to wear it. But it's cute for the springtime though, right? It's kind of got like a silky material. It's got flowers on it, it's short. You know, you can give them leg, give them sass. The size US four. And it still has the tags attached, never wore it. I have these boots from um, from Lola Chutique that I got a while ago. Wore them once, but you can't really tell. I don't know what the brand is. However, these boots are real leather and the hardware on it is pretty nice. These boots are kind of heavy. Um, and they have a really big wide tongue at the in the front. They do zip up on the side here. It's for easy access. So you don't have to unlace all of this. But let me tell y'all, these boots were $300 on Lola Chutique. Who buys $300 boots on Lola Chutique? I figured they are sellable uh, and I've only worn them once. They're in really, really good condition. So if you guys are looking for some combat boots like this, these are gonna be heavily discounted. You will be able to make an offer on these. I will have some like $10 pieces. Like these will be $10 because they are from Fashion Nova um, and they're Cape Robin, but these will be $10. I also have some thigh highs. These are green thigh highs, perfect for springtime, am I right? But they're super cute though, right? I thought these were cute. And they're stretchy and they fit skinny thighs really, really well. I am a size nine shoe though. So if you got big feet, which has skinny thighs, holla at me. Um, I wore these in a video, winter uh, holiday video. I wore these and that was the last time I touched them. Never worn out of the house. You guys, I've had these shoes since I lived with my parents. So I bought these shoes. These are Sam Edelman's, um, they're Sam Edelman. I wore these shoes to a birthday party and I posted a picture on Instagram. I'm gonna find the picture. And that was in 2011 or 2012, I wanna say. I believe it was 2012 going into 2013. Over six years and never worn them since then, but they're so pretty, so I'm gonna sell them They've been, they are velvet, so they are wintery. They're not really my style anymore. I'm gonna try them on. But they're so pretty. Ooh, girl, they kind of tight. Kind of tight on me. Can y'all see that? So these will be up for grabs. Make me an offer I can't refuse. Why do I have these? These are going to be $10. If anybody wants them, the, these are so big. This is bigger than my head, bro. Like, why do I own these? I don't understand. But somebody might love them. You may need them for something. You may have a photo shoot coming up and you wanna be fancy and do something like that. Do it, sis. I'm not judging you because I got them, okay? So I'm not judging. I am going to be selling a pair, a couple pairs of Fenty. These are the pointed ones that came out a while ago. Never wore them. Don't know why I got them because I definitely didn't wear them. 
I'm keeping the green ones, but I'm selling the pink ones. And the pink ones resale, I'm not sure for how much they resell for, but these are nice. I wore them once, so I will be selling these too. I'll be selling these. Super cute, right? They're just too small for me. These are a size six and a half in men's, which is an eight and a half in women's. Check me out, check me out. <laughs> So yeah, that's it. I hope that you guys kind of enjoyed this vlogish style video. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys really quickly. That's it. I'll talk to you guys in my next video, okay? Bye.